Uh, my thief has degenerate colored hair. He has blue hair because he's a fucking degenerate stealing stuff from people. Shame on you. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I'm your humble narrator, and we are here today in Hammerwatch with Walda from the Game Train. Uh, hello. <laughs> he's, uh, he's, he's, uh, one of them Eastern Europeans, you know, you heard so much about them. Well, they're here. They're here. We welcome to, welcomed them to America because communism is popular now, and, uh, we're gonna show these monsters how communism works. We're gonna go take their gold. Start it up! Despite what you might think, uh, <laughs> Slavs are real. They're real? Real good people. Okay, how do I do anything? Well, I don't know what you're using. I'm gonna use the gamepad because uh, I am a true Slavic gamer. Oh, man. Okay, so oh, now man. I'm gonna explain to you why I took dibs on a priest. He's not just a uh, priest Sukabled for a reason. He has the Kamehame of healing and destruction. If I shoot it in your face, it will heal you, but if I shoot it at the enemy's face, he will die. And I can make it better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, it goes through mana like crazy, so I need to get that upgraded. Oh, yeah, I guess I'm not regening very fast either. No, but that's Shut normal. Shut the bats up! Yeah, 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 yeah! Haha! -ha. So the last time I played this game, it was with another person. Some people might know him, but I won't say his name because I don't give a shit. <laughs> Is it Jerry from the Game Gallows? <laughs> no, I never played anything with him besides uh, Fistful of Frags, actually. Oh. He's a hard guy to get a hold of. He's like, be my friend on Steam, and then never talks to me. I'm like, alright. Yeah, I added him to man. Skype like three million years ago. Already the dinosaurs died, and I still haven't seen a thing from him. If that's how you feel about it, fine, man. Whatever. I mean, All right. I, I I can wait. It's not a big problem for me. But uh, I mean, a message every two centuries would be nice. Oh, I guess I'm full on health. So for the one poor individual who has no idea what this game is all about, basically, it's about communism. <laughs> basically, this game, <laughs> you are in a castle known as uh, Hammerwatch, I believe. Hence the name of the game, Hammerwatch. And some dickwad decided to put you in here, be like, here be treasures, go find them, and you fell for it. And somebody also destroyed the bridge which led you out of this place, in case of anything. So the rest of your party is like, uh, we're gonna find a way out, which we don't, by the way. So you're kinda stuck here on your own until you find the exit. We're gonna die in here! Well, it is very that's likely because <laughs> uh, there's one thing that we need to be on a complete lookout for, and that's planks. Planks? You wanna go secret area? Uh, what What does this say? One way teleport to floor 3. Use if you're no. more experienced. Yeah. It doesn't matter I'm if not you're experienced. Ex it wouldn't matter if you were experienced or not, we would miss out on tons of money. And we need it. Well, if we're not gonna escape the castle, then the money doesn't really matter. Oh, it's totally possible to escape it. The thing is, and this is spoilers, but I'm pretty sure nobody gives a shit about that in, on this channel. <laughs> yeah, it's it's been a fucking while <laughs> since this game was released. I'm sure nobody's gonna be hurt. <laughs> yeah, and if you are butthurt about spoilers, well... Hello. <laughs> yeah, that was sufficient warning. That was like 30 seconds of, hey, there's gonna be spoilers. Click away if yeah. you're fucking not down for it. <laughs> here, here be spoilers. If you don't get all of the planks, you die. Oh. <laughs> planks are necessary to escape from the castle because at the end it decides to pull a red faction on us. Particularly the red faction gorilla. Ooh. And if you never played that, well... Uh, you'll see what I mean, eventually. <laughs> Are we gonna get there? Are we really gonna do it? Are we gonna be the best? Well, I don't know if you'll get there in one sitting, but yeah, we will get there. Mm. I need some snackies. Fuck myself up. I have a pot of piss in <gasps> my pocket and I don't even know what to do with it. <laughs> don't drink it. 
Oh, you, you don't drink that. Creatures. You use it to baptize people. <laughs> you like that? Oh, ow, ow. Step into my they holy spit. kamehame. They spit! I hate it! Huh, <laughs> look at that. I opened up the, the gin and juice and uh, I got my mana back. Hmm. I guess Snoop Dogg was correct. That's right. It'll uh, it'll make you drunk, among other things. I'm, I'm sitting on gin and juice, laid back. Crystals. Where's my man? I'm a money. I'm a money. I'm a man. Oh God. You'd be surprised, but the first time I heard that song was in GTA V. Really? Yeah, I heard it on the radio while driving around, and I thought it was a pretty good song. Probably because it well, was fucking stupid. Well, you were wrong there. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good song. Who doesn't like stupid songs? Stupid songs yeah. make the best ones. I listen to Jonathan Colton constantly. Oh fuck, I exploded myself. Who the hell is Jonathan Colton? Uh, he sings the zombie, like, all we want to do is eat your brains, and then that's how I found him through uh, Left 4 Dead 2. And then I was like, I'm gonna go look up more of his songs. And uh, I was not disappointed. Never heard He's of got it. lots of silly songs. You should look him up. He's a singer-songwriter. Pretty cool guy. For the what American audiences out there, I'll say this one thing. If I haven't heard of it, it's not because uh, I didn't bother <laughs> to look it up. It's because it didn't exist. Whoa, that's a bold statement. <laughs> oh, look. Hi, vendor man. Look at that wall. Look at that wall. Do you see that thing? Yeah. That's a plank. A ladder? Oh, a plank. We must get it. How do we get over there? Well, that's simple, really. You need to go down here to where I went. And then oh. you will see a magical trick, which you would never think is possible. By the way, if you're using the gamepad, press back to open the map. I should press, uh, I should plug in my gamepad, but at the moment I'm on a keyboard like a noob. This is a very oh. suspicious wall, oh my god. There was a hole in that wall. Well, you, you can find strange holes in walls all over the place, but the ones <laughs> you're looking for are the ones that have red blinking eyes. I know what I'm looking for, oh yeah. And it's not I want the, the glory. looking for. Give me the glory! The glory of holes. <laughs> hmm, that could be a game. Best hole, glory hole. Oh, now you're the meat shield. You got all that health. Oh, that's okay, I can dodge. Feed me! Alright. Feed me foods! Step into the magic of Mehame. Watch. Oh, oh that is nice. Priest is best. Strange planks are scattered around the castle. Make sure not to miss any of them. And trust me, he oh. is correct about that. Last time yeah, I played that's... this, I missed about two. And it was just enough to die. <laughs> uh. Can I go over here? Hello? Hello, bats! It's a good idea to explore pretty much every floor thoroughly so that you can get all of the coins and not miss out on any of the secrets yeah don't you want your super loot super loot oh that's a huge ass coin it could make goldstein very fucking happy if he could get his hands on it but what does it do says the one unfortunate individual who hasn't played this game yet <laughs> well it makes you have discounts which makes goldstein even happier he doesn't want to give out a discount, does he? Oh, he doesn't give out the discount. He gets a discount. Oh. Oh, yes. That's different. Hmm. Exiting the floor also saves your game. No, I want to get the giant coin. Yes, it does save your game. But here's the thing. Since we're playing together, it's not going to let you go through the staircase by yourself. It will have to get both of us in there before something happens. Oh, there's another Ooh. coin. I hate these worms. They really are the worst enemy. Fender coins give you a price reduction. Yes, okay. that's what I just said. <laughs> Dumbass fucking game. Good thing Waldos here. I don't need to click any of those things, but I will. Yes. 
Well, there are several stores oh. in the game. Some are hidden. Okay. Combo. You could buy that actually. If you manage to fill it. up your combo bar, you will enter the combo state, which will allow you to do combos. It'll make your attacks better. Oh, healing while combos active. Continuously shoot a six-part nova while combos active. Yeah. Uh, I think combos work timer. best for melee characters, like the thief, for instance. The ones like the Pope or the Mage or the Archer, they don't really work that well because most of the time you don't get to kill things fast enough to rack up the combo. Yeah. So I would not recommend wasting your money for that. Instead, just get uh, other upgrades like more health or more damage. Luckily, I'm a super awesome melee character. Hooray! Who might be the one who dies the most. <laughs> Probably. That would not surprise me at all. At the, at the very tip of the top, we can see the most important things in life. The amount of keys we have, and the amount of lives we have. Since we are a bunch of cunts who do not want to play this finite <laughs> amount of lives, our lives <laughs> is currently infinite. Hooray! We're the best! This means that you won't lose the game even if you damn want to. But then again, who ow, wants ow. to lose a game? I think I can only think of one person, but if I say his name out loud, it's Jeremy. Uh, he might get upset. <laughs> well, uh, success is only, like, prescribed for you or something. That's what he'd say. I don't believe that he's... bullshit. No, he's got a strange philosophy about life. I think he sniffed too much glue. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe- Jeremy from the Game Gallows, <laughs> big shout out for sniffing all that glue. Proud yeah. of you. We love you, man. Kinda. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, I'm pretty ish. sure he knows well enough not to take my bullshit seriously. Oh my god. That's like the number one rule in East Europe. Don't take anyone's words seriously. Not that much we know. Not even your parents. <laughs> Oh, especially your parents. Why, they say they're gonna take you to Disneyland, and then they don't take you to Disneyland? What the fuck's up with that, man? They make all kinds of fucking jokes. And, and lies. <laughs> jokes are good, lies are bad. Especially when you're a little kid, and they're like, Oh, you know what, we sold your computer. And they just say it uh, in ha, the ha. most cold stoned voice ever. It's like, you you have a feeling that it might be bullshit, but you're not quite sure. Until you really find out. That it's and more bullshit. And then you cry. Oh. I thought it was real. Nah, that never happened. I could really use some <laughs> health. <laughs> uh, stay behind your meat shield. Oh, I died. <laughs> Uh, get, well, get good, bruh. <laughs> I, uh, I have infinite lives, so that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good, alright. Speaking of getting good, recently I've been uh, made privy to information about the Dark Souls 3 community, and they seem to be comprised mostly of salty invaders. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to that playthrough when it happens. I don't know much about Dark Souls 3, but, um... Me neither, which is why I'm gonna do a co-op playthrough with my friend Zach. Yeah. I know my, uh, my buddy Nate was like, Get Dark Souls, let's do it! And I was like, nah. Actually, I don't really want to. tried the first Dark Souls out some time ago, but, uh, I couldn't really get into it. I don't know, it just felt kind of lifeless for me. Which might be a bit of... <laughs> An irony thing there, cause I mean, you kind of play as a zombie, and you're fighting zombies most of the time, but I don't know, it just didn't feel like there was much going on most of the time. And of course, every well, friend of mine is like, oh, you just couldn't handle the controls. No, it has nothing to do with that. Sure, the controls are a bit weird, and it's not something that's, for instance, you would see in Darksiders. Shitty. Like, like for instance, you wouldn't see that kind of control scheme in Darksiders too. Um, I will not hesitate to say that the Dark Souls control scheme feels shitty. It could have been done a lot better. 
and I know there's probably gonna be some fanboys who come <laughs> at me for that, but uh, I stand by my fucking my statement. Well, the, the, Could have done it better. The thing is, it probably was done like that on purpose to instigate a challenge, but in that case, I gotta say, shitty controls do not make a good challenge. Exactly, like, yeah, I have a, a controls section on every review that I do, and it's like, artificial fucking difficulty. God damn it! Gotta watch out for <laughs> those uh, spiny little bastards. Yeah, they got me real good. Ugh, back again, jiggity jog. But even if the controls weren't all that bad, I would still probably not like the game all that much, because control is one thing, the rest of the game is another. And well, yeah, it gets frustrating, for sure. It suddenly gets really frustrating, yeah, fighting the enemies is in a very slow, clunky way is kind of annoying. I prefer something more akin to Streets of Rage, where it's all fast and pumping. Yeah. But, uh, like I said, the game felt lifeless. There was, for the most part, no music, and that's a big no for me. I don't, I don't know. I mean, I'm, it was like orchestral, wasn't it? But, I can't remember the game that well. But it only plays every so often, only on boss fights. Yeah. Most of the that's time, true. it's just fucking ambience. Like, if I want ambience, I'll just open up the window. I don't live if in I a basement. If I want ambience, I'll buy a fucking synth pad and do it myself. I'll do it myself! I don't live in a basement, I can open up my window whenever I want to for some good old ambience. And even then, the, amb the ambience wasn't that good, it's just sometimes wind. <sighs> I don't know, the first Dark Souls wasn't that interesting, but uh, I did get to see quite a bit of Dark Souls 3 and I felt that it might be a bit better than its predecessors, which is why I agreed to the co-op playthrough in the first place. Well, that's one of the reasons. <laughs> well, second reason is, it's uh, new and awesome. Second reason People is, like I it. don't get to buy, buy it for myself, so... <laughs> Oh. I might as well. <laughs> oh god, spinies! Go away, spinies! I don't. I hate them. I don't see no reason not to play it if I don't have to pay for it. It's the least Got I can do. Got my combos. Well, yeah. I mean, <laughs> if it's free, I'll fucking play basically anything. Yeah, if it's free, I'll at, at the very least beat it once with the friends. That's that's my policy at least. I'll try to get the I most love out of free games. Well, who, oh my god! Who doesn't like free games? <laughs> ah. Yeah, well, that's why I try and make the effort on the channel. I'm like, hey, this is free on itch.io. Go play it. It's awesome. I kind of forgot I to mention this one thing about Hammerwatch. All these nice shekels that are laid throughout the castle, they're not exactly for. For your own personal collection. If you pick up a coin, I get the same coin too. Oh. So if you find well, good. if you find coins, that's nice. However, I f I don't remember if. Oh, okay. You just confirmed my suspicions. If you pick up the coin, it's <laughs> gone for good. It's just that we both get it at the same time, which is good. Yeah. So nobody's fighting over loot and shit. There's food for you. But then the question is. So if somebody buys an upgrade, does he lose? Does the other guy lose the money as well? The answer is no. Oh, you son of a bitch! <laughs> so how does it work? So everyone can pick up the money, but uh, from that point on, it's in your own uh, pocket. It doesn't get subtracted for somebody else's bullshit. Which is what? Oh, good. Which is what you would expect the money to do. Maybe. But I mean, some developers would probably think, "No, that's not fair. I, I want to be more bullshit." <laughs> like uh, Gauntlet. Do we do that? It started Gauntlet? out pretty bullshit. Yeah, you don't you don't share loot in Gauntlet. I remember fighting with like all my friends. <laughs> I only. I need fucking gold. I only played uh, a little bit of Gauntlet on Sega Genesis, but uh, I don't know, it, it was alright, I just didn't notice anything like that. Wizard need food badly. I don't need food. If you open Get up the map, 
you will be able to see this interesting line going through your bubble that shows where your friend is it's like a compass for friends now if only we could have that in real life especially when we don't have friends don't they have one for like your dog <laughs> i wouldn't know i don't have any dogs really no i hate dogs you what oh please enlighten me <laughs> as to how my decision to hate dogs is so bad dogs are awesome they're friendly and fun i guess so but it doesn't help my case that i grew up in an environment of very aggressive dogs see that's that's the owner's problem not the dog's problem well we never owned Damn. any dogs that's the that's another thing it was all the other dogs see and once you got your own dog you'd be like holy shit these dogs are awesome i don't know i'm i'm a lazy bastard i don't want to go walk it all the fucking time that's true too. I, I buy rats, even though I really like dogs, because you don't have to walk a rat. <laughs> they just live in their cage and they're kind of happy. I got cats okay. instead. They can walk themselves. But they're so mean. <clears throat> I don't know. It kind of depends on the cat's character and also how you treat it. But that, that's, true. that's the same for just about any animal, I think. Because I've seen people cuddling the fucking Komodo dragons. Aww. Which does look fucking cute, I gotta say. Even though it, it is a Komodo dragon, something that can easily eat you for lunch. <laughs> he a good boy. He didn't do nothing. Didn't do nothing. He was a good didn't boy. Didn't do nothing. He's gonna be a lawyer. He's a, he's a true didn't do nothing. <laughs> Oh, that's a gold key. It allows us to open a gold door. Oh. Ah, lottery. Oh. You get jack and shit. <laughs> what does it all mean? Oh, fuck. Uh, if you find a room like this, just hit the middle button and play the lottery. Sometimes you'll get good no gear. No one has gotten all four re rewards. What? Yeah, sometimes you get good gear, sometimes you just get fucking lives. In our case, it's worthless. I've, yeah. I personally have never seen four rewards pop up, but I've seen three. And most of the time they're not really worth the time. It's mostly potions and lives. Potions are alright. I think this golden one that I got right now just regenerates everything for you. There is one which makes you invincible for a bit. And you'll get the chance to buy it before every boss. Ugh. So, in case you have trouble with bosses, you can just buy that to make your life easier. It's not very expensive. <laughs> I have trouble with video games, so yeah. I don't. <laughs> I would like to say that I don't, but that would be a lie. I like to say that I don't, but that would be a lie. That I... that I... Uh... That I do? <laughs> well, you know what I meant. Don't as in, don't do good in the game. Yes. Oh, my, my, my priest is dead. Priest don't die. Priest resurrect. Oh, he's back. Oh! Priest do not die. We just, oh, uh, uh, go visit Krishna. This is so bad. Say again. So bad. Oh, fuck. Oh, I died. We, we just need to collect our uh, resurrection card. That's all. We need to get that stamped. Every time we die. <laughs> they say every ah, Jesus, I'm back again. They say every hundred stamps you get a, a free reincarnation as something that's not a, a shitty bug or something. I can get behind that. Well, you don't get that with Jesus. That's true. Jesus just wants you to give up everything for him and get nothing in return. He's a cunt. But he's my cunt! Why hell he is? He's the one I picked! Here, I'm gonna hide in here. Ow. No, you can't. Ow. <laughs> Ow. As you can probably Ow. tell, there's, uh, <laughs> there's a thing shooting spikes from the floor. What the fuck is it? It's, a, it's an anus. It's Mr. Anus. 
I don't like it. Well, it doesn't matter if you like it or not. Mr. Anus doesn't like you, and that's all that matters. <laughs> you should put it out of its misery. Oh god. I hate it. How do you make it stop? Just keep punching it. It's that plant thing? Yes. Now, once I get those upgrades rolling, it'll be much better. <laughs> Alright. Oh, it's dead. Oh, I was running around for nothing then? Wonderful, wonderful. Here's a button. Look at that guy. He's a majestic beast of nature. We must talk with what? him. For he will Hello? make us buff. Ooh, knives damage. Speed penalty one. Okay. I'll take both of these. Oh, we already got uh, in the range of about thousands of dollar dues. That's pretty good. We're rich! So rich! For now. I think we came through here, right? Oh, that's the gold door. The golden door! It's definitely hard to play the melee characters. Yeah, which is why I never play as them. Fuck them. It's a good challenge. Fuck that, I just wanna win. <laughs> yeah, I'm the sort that uh, picks random characters every time on a fighting game just because it's like... a challenge. I'm the kind of person who doesn't play fighting games. Cause fuck it. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. We play Brawlhalla. <laughs> it's not a fighting game, that's just Smash. It's, uh... Yeah. I know I triggered someone Double. by that. <laughs> it's okay. Smash is a fighting game! It's okay. The butthole will subside eventually. Oh yeah, combo breakers, yeah! I don't really consider Smash-like games to be fighters, because they're not in the same bracket of fighting games. Uh, they definitely have their own twist to them, but... I mean, you are fighting. <laughs> well, you are, but it's more like a beat-em-up than a, an actual tournament fighter. Yeah, that's true. There's not many, like, combos and shit like that. No. No special moves except your B button. And that's one thing I like about Brawlhalla. Everybody's moveset is, like, kind of similar. Everyone just uses the heavy attacks because nobody wants to use the light ones. Yeah. And that's how you I mean, the keep light ones killing are super everyone as though. a lion. Yeah, the light attacks are only effective if, like, they're trying to give you fucking face-to-face -face shit. But usually that doesn't happen in Brawlhalla. You'll just, like, merc some dudes, and then they come back, and you merc them some more. I really hate. Ow. I think the only thing I'd have an easier time in than Bra Brawlhalla at this moment would be Battlefront 2. Battlefront? Star Wars Battlefront 2. Yeah, I, I gave that one a pass. I did enjoy the original Battlefront, but I was like, eh. You say what to me? <laughs> you heard it. You sacrilegious suka? <laughs> Battlefront 2 is where true men go to settle the score. Is that true? Of course. Well, that or Modern Blade Warband. Oh my god. We'll do some chivalry. Fuck your chivalry. <laughs> chivalry! Modern Blade Warband is the better choice. The chivalry have fucking clunks? Hell no. Not yet. Never, It's only ever. been out for a decade. <laughs> uh, this trap on easy mode is actually disabled. Oh. So you can just walk past it. But who the hell would play on easy mode? What are you, a scrub? Play on normal at least. Don't be a bitch. Yeah. Normal. We're all normal here! It's perfectly fucking normal here! If you play this game on easy mode, then I can only guess that you play Serious oh Sam God. on Tourist. Uh, for a playthrough or like a stream, I might play it on easy. I'd put that past myself just because, uh... Fuck that noise. It, go hardcore or go home. It is more of a touristy thing. <laughs> it is more touristy though. 
You're like, I want to concentrate on my commentary, not my uh, suckage of the game. Please, thanks. <laughs> I don't give a shit about that. Where's my friend? I'm just enjoying a party with the slugs. They seem to be kind of upset, though. Who brought the bats? Oh. 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 Speaking of which, actually, the bats did something that uh, you probably missed because of your unfortunate accident. They ran into the trap. You can use this to your advantage with other enemies. You can make them go through traps and kill themselves. They're not too smart about that. Just lay a bomb. Don't even need to lay a bomb, just go through the timed spike pits and shit. Oh yeah. Like we just did. Yes. You're using the keyboard right now? Mm-hmm. Oh, well I don't remember what the map key on that is. But you probably want to find it. Makes your it's life easier. Tab. It's tab. It's tab. Yeah, I looked up all the uh, key bindings. Who the fuck uses tab for a map? <laughs> it's convenient. It's right near those uh, Q and whatnots. Oh, hell, it's convenient. It's good if you want to check the player boards and whatnot. I really need more mana. Well, what's this? Yeah, we should have picked that uh, five times mana regen shit. Oh, a, a secret passage. Well, I do like that. Oh, wait, we kind of need to go there. I'll go there. You can have fun with the worms, I'll go do some uh, spec ops. Oh god. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh, you'll be fine. <laughs> you have not seen the worst that life has to offer. This is uh, near the top, isn't it? Isn't this near the top? Nah. It feels like it's near the top. Near the top would be Chicken Run. Chicken Run? The movie? The game. Oh. <laughs> the game about the movie? The movie, the game. I should say. The movie, the game. The Lion King, the movie, the game. Well, the Chicken Run game isn't that bad. It's just that the last part of it. Ugh. Because you gotta build that fucking plane, which we did in the movie. Yeah. And you gotta kickstart an old tractor engine too. Oh, is that a lot of fun? I have it recorded too. Well, only took two tries after many years of intense practice. <laughs> I'm gonna die! I don't wanna die! Well, you won't. But you're gonna need to kill those slugs. Oh. Man. I have a priest. That's helpful. I think priest was only <sighs> added sort of recently, like relative to the, the game's release. Yeah, I don't think I remember the priest the last time I was playing this. Uh, the priest was, is relatively new. As new as it can be at this point in time, I mean. <laughs> yeah. But it didn't come the out game uh, is old. right away. Took a bit of effort to get that thing. Oh, wait a minute. I can get to you through a shortcut. How? Yes. I'll just go there instead. Won't have to go through the trap. <laughs> Won't that be a treat? In fact, I'm already almost there. I can see you on the map. Yeah, kill him. Yeah, kill him dead. On the map, you can see not only how much money you have, but how many times you died. Be warned though, the death counter is not always accurate. Oh, you have more deaths than me. Yeah, but sometimes it likes to glitch out and go into the range of hundreds. I hate this fucking plant thing. Are you kidding me? He's dead. <sighs> Yay! Yay! Congratulations, you have been converted to Islam. <laughs> oh no.
Oh, well, at, at least they cured my scars. Now you have to pay us the, the fees, the zakia, or, or else you will have 1,000 lashes. Exactly. That's why I ain't down for it. I'm like, look, what you're doing, it ain't fair. Oh, but that's okay. It ain't uh, fair to nobody. No, that's okay. You you can leave Islam whenever you want to. It's just that, <laughs> it's just that the only penalty for leaving is death. Yeah, no big deal. No, you can handle that. No big that. deal. It, it's all right. This is acceptable. Perfectly fine. Apparently, for a lot of the world, it is. Or they're just too fucking pussy to say anything about it. Ah, oh, tell me about it. Ah, Nowadays, people are just throwing all kinds of bullshit around. It's fucking annoying. Well, we can't talk about how Islam is a bad because that's being racist and Islamophobic. Like, fucking hell. It's okay. Well, don't they do some things that uh, might cause a phobia, like murdering people in droves? Well, that causes a bit of a phobia for me. I don't know. Well, I don't know. It's like, it's like the entire religion is kind of incompatible with the Western societies, but no, let's not talk about that. That's, that's racist. Yeah, that's hate speech, dude. Just shut the fuck up. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. I don't give a shit. Oh, a plank. A strange plank? Question mark? What? what what's Ooh. so strange about it? It's made out of wood. Fucking idiot. It's big. It's heavy. It's wood. My oh God. no. Oh, watch out for big bug. He has a health bar. Hmm. My holy Marys only do 10 damage against him. Yeah, my shit goes 8-8. Eight, eight. So 16, I guess pretty good. But I'd really not to, like to not die. Alright, he's dead. Oh my god. He also <laughs> dropped a mana upgrade. <gasps> huh, cool. I figured out what the yellow potion does. <sighs> it fully restores everything. Oh. So if you... F Super potion. Yeah, so if you find the gin and juice, make sure to save it for the best moment. <laughs> so you can get laid Ow. back. Laid back! With my mind on my gold and my gold on my mind! You wanna pick that thing up. What is that? It's an apple. But it's not just any apple. It's an orange apple. Super fruit! Now you, I get my super fruit on. Now I know some of you are thinking, an orange apple, what are you saying? This sounds like the, the most retarded thing I ever heard. Now, now hear me out, hear me out. You know how orange is the greatest fruit of all time? Fact. It's fact, because well, not... Well, besides strawberries. Well, the thing about oranges is that not only do you eat them, but you drink them at the same time. You can drink apple juice. Oh, but it's much more difficult. It's like when you bite into a potato. Yeah, you get some juice out of it too, but it's not as easy. <laughs> That's true. But with orange, it's basically fruit and juice at the same time. It's so ingenious. But then you have apple, and it's like this the, all the good things about the orange, but the taste of an apple. It And that alone makes you regenerate health to the max. Superior fruits! I'm all about superior fruits. How do I get that key? Oh, there's... Do I smack oh, a wall? Oh, that's not a key. That's a one-up. What is it? Oh, then I don't care. <laughs> oh, it's, it, it's just life. Fuck. I don't need that shit. Jesus Christ, Combo that's a big timer spider. two. Combo healing. I should probably take. Combo nova. So, summer officially started, and with it, all the bugs woke up. Do you have cicadas? No, I have a huge fucking spider crawling right in front of me. Yeah, that's not as fun. Nah, I just hope he doesn't go straight for the computer, because <clears throat> he will get chopped. <laughs> <laughs> it's not safe! Oh my god. Now I've done a bad thing. I know there is one sick bastard who likes uh, spiders because they're totally friendly. Fuck you, cunt. 
They're not friendly, especially when your only source of shitting location, the outdoors toilet, has a fucking black widow just chilling in the corner. He just wants to be your friend. That's what I call extreme shitting. <laughs> hey, I'm watching you poop. That's cool. And the worst part about that. it, it's in the corner where the light switch is at. <laughs> he knows. I'm not joking about this. I actually scared. had this happen to me. Before when I God. when I still was in Lithuania and uh, I was still young, we didn't have a toilet in the house because it wasn't very common to have one of us around. So we, we had to use the outdoors thing. And for some reason a fucking black... For some reason a black widow decided to move in there and chill at the fucking light switch. Well, because you didn't evict him immediately. You need to let him know that this is a serious situation. Well, it's kind of difficult to evict it out when it's in the middle of the night and you're just shitting in a hole. <laughs> <laughs> I believe in you. You can do it. It's also the time where there was uh, a common dog, or so to say. It's like somebody owned a dog, but he was basically everyone's dog. Chilled out with everyone. Of course, at that point I was like maybe five or six. I didn't know better. <laughs> and it, it didn't help no. that it was big and black too. So when, you didn't it, you didn't have your dog prejudice back then. <laughs> no, but it didn't help that it looked fucking scary every fucking time I saw it waiting outside of a shitter. <laughs> he just wants to be your friend. Well, I, I appreciate uh, the sentiment, but uh, no thank you. Come on! Let him be your friend! Come on! He's a good boy! It's, he didn't do nothing. It's too late for that dog. <laughs> yeah, he's probably dead. <clears throat> yeah, the poor bastard got run over by a truck. Oh. Then he's definitely dead. He's totally dead. Oh my god. You look like you could use a patch. <laughs> it's just that fucking spiky floor man. Oh, that guy. He keeps doing bad things. Uh, if I could only get a hold of those crystals over there and smoke them, I could uh, teach it about uh, the healing word of the Jesus Christ. Oh yeah! Combo, 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 combo wombo. Mm, I guess I'll do that with the next guy. <laughs> In the meanwhile, I, I can taught fix him about you up. the healing words of uh, the rogue. That rogue. Oh, I oh guess I'm not gonna fix you up then. <laughs> You've been struck by a smooth bat. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.